I think we're we're probably getting towards the the top and 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 in my opinion heading into the year before an election year I think things are going to be artificially better than what they really are so I think gas prices are going to go down I think interest rates are going to go down so everything seems great um what happens after that is 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 what's to be decided it could go really good or it could go worse than where we're at there not that we're in a bad place now but it could go worse than what they expected us to be at the end of last year was all about inflation it was all about the the real estate market crashing and interest rates and i and i and that didn't happen right we had a lull but it, it didn't happen but i but i do believe that we're probably kicking the can down the road a little bit and there's certain problems that will come up later and i think there's other states that are feeling the squeeze a little bit i agree those are the states that the the high swings yeah yeah and we just have never historically had those in the midwest so we're pretty blessed in that aspect of when we're talking to interest rates um, there's no inventory that's what it all comes down to it's supply and demand right 